Hey YouTube, it's your girl Queen P and you already know what it is. I'm back with another video, you feel me? So look, since everybody can come and say what the fuck they want to say and everybody can make reaction videos popping up every five seconds, then they just made a reaction video and then they got to pop another one back in. Um, Like somebody said something to you in a matter of that many seconds that you had to come out with another video but okay anyways but um i'm not gonna be negative about this video i'm really not i'm just i just feel like people be up these you these reactors asses sometimes and they don't see the bigger picture um but it's fine you know ride for your you know subscriber i do i ride for mine you know, I ride for, you know, who I watch, you know, some of them anyways. Um, but we about to do a reaction video on this video, this other reactor video. And y'all already, already gonna know who it is. So, it is what it is. I really don't fucking care. But right now, it's really starting to, like, get under my skin. I don't know. Like, some vibes, I don't know. I was, like, really fucking with her. But now I'm just, like, you know. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Because it just don't make no fucking sense. But anyways, I'm going to do my reaction videos. And if anybody got something to say about it, I don't give a fuck. I live in Fort Worth, Texas. When you come to Fort Worth, Texas, hit me up. Because, baby, I got a car, Okay. I can meet you anywhere, anywhere, anywhere in the DFW area. Let me know and we can meet up and we can put it on live if you want to, too. So if anyone got a problem with Queen P, let me know. I'll give you my address. But anyway, back to this video. So let's get into it. Uh, what's really with all these reaction video makers addressing reaction video makers? Like... I mean, am I not mistaken or what the fuck? Y'all all making reaction videos. It don't matter how the fuck you put your reaction video, where you put it, how you upload it, how you title it. A reaction video is a reaction video, regardless of what the fuck you're talking about. You're giving your opinion on something. I'm not un. And she's cur she's right. You're giving your opinion on, you know. These reactions are, re are your reaction or whatever. And nobody's saying that you can't give an opinion or have your two cents in. But how I feel, this is how I feel, me, Queen P, how I feel is that if you're trying to give your opinion, why does it have to be so bashful? Why does it have to be so hateful? Why does it have to be so negative? You know, like you post something negative all the time. All the damn time you post something negative. Why can't you post something positive for once? Like, understanding where the fuck people are coming off thinking one opinion is better than the other one, and all it is better than the other one if it's not in a negative light. If the message is positive, it's definitely better than the person who's you know telling it in a negative, nasty, spiteful way. Yes, then it is better. This and that because you word your words differently is meaning something different what the fuck if you tell them their house is dirty the house is dirty regardless of how the fuck you say it if she ain't gonna clean the house she's not gonna clean it regardless exactly how, how you say it. it it's not what you say it's how you say it it's not what you say it's how you say it don't come to my motherfucking house if my house is dirty you ain't gonna be like bitch why is your motherfucking house dirty you know it's not what you say it's how you say it Girl, why is your house not neat? You know, it, I don't know. I'm just real different. I think before I say something, um, I care about other people's feelings. You know, I'm considerate of others. So I don't just say something just to say it. You know, I'm going to think about it and say it. You know, what's not going to be in a meanful way? What's not going to be mean? How can I say this that's not going to be in a meanful, hateful way? That's just me. Coming out, shooting shots at other reaction video makers is really just showing your true color. 
Now we're going to stop here. And she said that shooting our shots at other reaction videos is showing our true colors. Mm. So us coming out against the negative reactors, asking them why are they bashing them? Why are they calling out their name, calling them out their name? Why are they talking about their kids? Why are they, you know, just doing all the negative? Why you, why you can't be positive about the message that you're trying to send out? Why you got to be negative about it? That's showing our true colors. If that's showing our true colors, that's what's up. Because that means we're sticking up for people who are being done wrongly. And you wrong, blah, my eats. You is wrong. You is wrong. That's not showing our true colors. If it is, that's showing our true colors in a positive way. In a positive way. may think you're making a point and you may think you're proving something or saying something but you just and another thing, some of y'all reactors are not Scarface. So, so so stop thinking that people got to be scared of y'all. Stop, you know, and then y'all, you know, subscribers or whatever thinking that we need to be scared of y'all. We is not scared of y'all. Period at all. Are you showing your true color or are you just really showing that you're not um secure with yourself? You're not secure with what you were doing. We're not we're not <laughs> Girl, this girl, we're not secure with ourselves because we just posted a video asking negative reactors why are they being so negative. So since we posted a positive video talking about coming for the negative reactors and all that, you know, we're insecure. We're not secure with ourselves. How is that we're not secure with ourselves because we want to just know why you being so nasty and mean and negative towards these women baby you're not secure with yourself if that's the case because we're not the ones bashing somebody of their weight we're not the ones bashing somebody that you know their their house is dirty we're not the ones bashing people's kids we're very secure with ourselves we're very in tuned with ourselves are you Let's go on. That's how I feel about it. Like, mm -hmm. like it's a whole, <laughs> that shit is funny. It like, is funny. Video makers are making videos about reaction video makers saying they shouldn't. But we're doing it in a positive way. Yeah, y'all shouldn't be. Like, y'all don't have no type of empathy. No type of, you know morals nothing no god within you to be being so mean and nasty and evil like that like put god in your life for real he really will change your whole just mind frame your whole outlook on life you know what i'm saying he really would you know he really would. That's all I'm saying. God, he he's a miracle worker. Let's go. Do this, shouldn't do that. Whoop, whoop, this and that. What the fuck? Y'all all out here doing the same damn thing. Giving an opinion on something else somebody else doing. Or saying, period, big dot, little dot, period, poo. Yep, we is giving an opinion. We is, you know, making reaction videos about somebody else's life. But what y'all seem to not realize is that when we make our reaction videos, we make it positive. We do not try to bash. We do, do, we do not try to bring down. We do not try to hit when someone is down. We do not try to bash. We don't do none of that. When we make a reaction video... We try to make it positive as possible. You know what I'm saying? We try to put ourselves in their shoes. You know what I'm saying? And some of us actually have family or friends that are going through the same thing. So we empathize with these people. We understand. We are mothers. So we know that it's hard raising kids. You know, making videos, going to work. You know, we know this. 
That's why we are not trying to be rude or hateful or evil when it comes to making our reaction videos. Because we understand. We know. We get it. Do you? Let's keep going. Period. Dot, dot. Period. All of them dot. Like, it's nothing else, nothing more. And like I said, I don't give a fuck who comes for me. Period. I really don't. woman with a vagina or it's a man with a penis. It might be but she does the most. She Come on now. She does the most. And y'all know she does the most. Oh, y'all fucking that. know she does the most. The but some of y'all so far up her ass that y'all don't see it. And, and it's okay if you don't see it. Because I know people like her that will talk shit about somebody. You know, but then people will back them the fuck up till the wheels fall off. And don't even feel like they are wrong. Don't even feel like they doing something wrong. And that's fucked up. What the fuck is going on? For real? A lot of people saying they not trying to do anything for the bag or for views. But I'm starting to be a little skeptical. Of what and what are you doing? You put a video out every five seconds, girl. Like, you put a motherfucking video out every five seconds. So what the fuck are you talking about that we doing shit for views and... Um, all of that because we want to put a video out talking positively because we want to put a video out asking negative reactors why they are so negative why are they so so mean and conniving like what happened in your life who was not nice to you as a child you know what I'm saying but anyways y'all I'm just saying I'm not trying to be negative. I'm not trying to be evil about the situation. But sometimes shit needs to just be said. And some people just need to put in they, be put in their motherfucking place. And Blama East is one of those persons. And I don't care. I have a lot. I watch a lot of. I watch a lot of YouTubers. Who support Blama East. And it's fine. You know. Because I don't have no problem with them. Because I like them. You know what I'm saying? And yes, I did say in my other video that I like you and I'm subscribed to you. And I am subscribed to you. And I will continue to be subscribed to you. I don't have no problem with her. The only problem I have is her attitude. Her personality. You know what I'm saying? And people might be like, well, Liv got the same. Per well, not Liv got the same. Because if you fuck with Blah, you ain't going to say Liv got the same personality. You might say that her personality is worse. But... I'm just saying, I see what I see. That's all I'm saying. I see what I see. I see you post videos back to back. I see them post videos, but I see them post videos, you know, going to the store, going, you know, Halloween costume shopping, um, going this place, going that place, uh, cleaning the house. Um, I see them, um, interacting with their kids i see them you know making lives talking about this talking about that i don't really be seeing all that about what they be saying about you blah i don't i'm sorry i just don't because like i said i see what i see i don't get dms i don't get text messages i don't get phone calls oh girl you heard what olivia said about blah mouth oh you heard what jazzy said about blah mouth. oh you know olivia and jazzy ain't friends no more no i don't get none of that i see what i see when i see it when they post it okay now, like I said, I don't have no issue with Blah, but her personality and her, and her, the way that she is and acts makes you ugly and just nasty. And I'm sorry, it is what it is. But I'm not holding my tongue no more because, girl, all of y'all can just be like on Blah my side, up her ass, saying that she right for what she doing, how she, you know, she did, she that. Ain't no more advice from Blah Mouth to Olivia or Jazz. Blah Mouth do not like Olivia or Jasmine. We know that. We see that. So ain't no more positivity or trying to be, you know, giving advice to them. It's just straight bashing. It's just straight bashing. You feel me? But anyways, I wasn't trying to make this video long. I just really wanted to come out here because, y'all, I'm really, she really starting to get under my skin. She really is. And I'm not about to sit here and make my channel about blah. But when I feel something in my spirit, in my soul, and it's just trying to get out. And I'm just 
compressing it with positivity. I'm compressing it. I'm holding it in with positivity, just trying to be positive, you know, trying to, you know, stay away from the negative. But when you holding something in, when you holding or biting your tongue, that shit hurt. You feel me? Like you just got to release it sometimes. And like I said, I ain't trying to make my, my, my channel negative. That's what it's not about. But some people need to be put in their motherfucking place. And like I said, if anybody got a problem or if anybody, you know, trying to come for Queen P, I live in Fort Worth, motherfucking Texas. Okay? Y'all know where McCart Avenue is? McCart and uh, what else that street is? Uh, what else? I don't remember. But I know it's off of McCart. McCart Avenue, y'all know what that is? Y'all know what that is? By Sycamore and, you know, Hilltop right there? Yeah, that's where I stay. Mm -hmm. But anyways, y'all, because, I mean, I just couldn't, you know, and then after I saw that video, I was like, I know she not coming for me. I know she not addressing me, but you are addressing other people who are, you know, addressing the negative reactors. And I'm a part of that group because I'm addressing you. Because you are negative. And I know it's not going to get through to you. I know that this, that, you know, those messages of people asking what's going on and why you're so negative. I know it's not going to get to you because that's just how you are. That's just your personality. And I know that because I know someone like you. And I've been knowing them for years. And I just got to learn and get used to their personality that's just how their personality is you know what i'm saying and then you know it is what it is but sometimes you just got to put people in their place you know what i'm saying and like i feel like you are one of those persons that sometimes really just got to be put in a place and like no one i see is doing it everyone is just up your ass and riding for you you know what i'm saying and girl like mm -mm. but anyway so i'm about to get out of here and i'll see y'all in my next video